सो हेलो गाइज वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर रिव्यूइंग अ ब्रांड न्यू कस्टम रोम दिस रोम इज पिक्सल एक्सपीरियंस एंड आई एम रिव्यूइंग द पिक्सल एक्सपीरियंस फॉर द वेरी फर्स्ट टाइम बिकॉज दिस टाइम इट कम्स विद द मी आई कैमरा नो टॉकिंग अबाउट द बैटरी बैकअप इन दिस रोम एज यू कैन सी द बैटरी बैकअप इज डिसेंट एंड यू कैन सी टू डे इज मंडे एंड from 12 am to 10 pm the idle drain is decent then there was some usage like youtube then pixel launcher this is the default launcher then uh, i used a bit of google and then play store to install some apps that was my basic usage then on uh, saturday i used amazon camera play store uh, i did a bit of gaming even and youtube of course so the device lasted decently long and there were no issues with the battery backup not talking about the customization in this rom this is a pixel experience rom so obviously you don't get any customization whatsoever so yeah there are no customization except you can just choose your wallpapers and stuff you can enable or disable dark theme from here and you can also enable themed icons and that's pretty much it you can customize app grid and that's pretty much it i think you can't customize much of the aspects of the rom uh, it is meant to provide you with a pixel experience as the name suggests so there's that now talking about the camera application in this rom as i already told you This ROM comes with the MIUI camera. This is the default MIUI camera, which ships with MIUI 13 and above. So uh, there's that. There there is no aperture camera and all that crap this time around. So I'm really liking this ROM in that aspect. Even that was the only reason I wasn't reviewing Pixel Experience, because for me to daily drive a rom it must have miui camera uh, because aperture camera is straight up bad i can compromise even with the dolby atmos or uh, any sound solution but i can't compromise with any of the aperture camera solution and all that and uh, i do need miui camera that's why i'm reviewing this rom so late but there is a question in my mind now what happens to the pixel os because pixel os was basically pixel experience but with the miui camera now that the pixel experience itself is shipping with the miui camera uh, what's the point of having pixel os so let's see what happens in the custom rom community uh, pixel os will have its own unique advantage in the future maybe it will ship with the dolby atmos and stuff we will see in the future Now talking about the Play Store certification, as you can see, the device is certified. So the banking apps work decently fine. I use Phone Pay for my daily transactions, and I haven't faced any problem whatsoever. So banking apps work perfectly fine. There are no issues with that because this ROM ships with the Pixel storage, so there is no issues with the storage whatsoever. You get the unlimited photos and video storage. not talking about the benchmark in this rom my mind was actually blown after seeing this score uh, it has 4 lakh 78000 score it's pretty much mind blowing at this point because when i started flashing custom roms in this device the custom roms used to score around 3 lakh 20000 or 3 lakh 30000 and it's 70000 more than what it used to score Uh, a few years ago almost 6 months or 7 months ago so it is a pretty huge deal in my opinion like stuff like gaming photo editing video editing is extremely smooth in this rom obviously you don't get any fancy 90 fps in this rom as this is a pixel experience so you don't get any types of tweaks even in uh, bgmi you get 40 fps but the 40 fps is constant and your device doesn't overheat at all i've been gaming for hours and hours and uh, i didn't find any overheating whatsoever for comparison this video is being recorded on samsung galaxy a52 and this device has a snapdragon 778g and this device scores like 5 lakh 52000 or something 
and that's the score 5 lakh 20 thousand i don't remember but it's around 5 lakh 50 thousand or something or 5 lakh 20 thousand or something but uh, the price difference between this phone and uh, that phone is huge like this phone came out like this phone was launched at 35,000 I think and this phone was launched at 20,000 so that is a pretty huge deal in my opinion and it is also a proof that custom ROMs do enhance performance in your device and on that note uh, if you like this video give it a like subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one bye bye now